What's happening guys? Hope you're having a great day wherever you are. Today I'm gonna be showing you how to make some birthday cake overnight oatmeal. And as far as overnight oatmeal goes, this is as close to birthday cake as it gets, guys. This is really, really good. Super tasty and super easy too. So let's hop right into this one and get cooking. All right guys, so the first thing you wanna do is take out a large bowl and add in a quarter cup of old fashioned oats, a tablespoon of chia seeds, about a half a tablespoon of the sugar substitute of your choice, a tablespoon of vanilla whey protein powder, a quarter cup of low fat or non-fat Greek yogurt, a teaspoon of vanilla extract, a tablespoon of sugar-free or calorie-free maple syrup, and a half a cup of unsweetened vanilla almond milk. Now what you can do is just go ahead and take a spatula and mix all of those ingredients together until they're well combined. Pour those into a sealable jar, seal that jar up, wait about six to eight hours or just let them sit in the fridge overnight. Add your sprinkles and then just go ahead and get in there with a spoon, guys. As you can see, these oats are super, super thick. It's like a slice of overnight oat birthday cake. It's really amazing and I hope you guys enjoy it. So that's gonna do it for today, guys. If you want the full recipe with the metric measurements or you wanna pick up any of the stuff that I used in today's video, all that is in the video description below. By the way, guys, question of the day, if it was your birthday, what flavor birthday cake would you choose? Would you choose vanilla? Would you choose chocolate? Would you choose ice cream cake? That's not really a flavor, but it's still delicious. Strawberry, let me know in the comments below. I'm just interested. My birthday is next month, so it's coming up quick. I think I'd go with ice cream cake, but I'll let you guys know my final answer in the comments below. But if you like today's video, go ahead and hit the like button, hit the thumbs up button. It just really helps the video out a lot. Subscribe if you're not subscribed already, and I will see you guys in the next video.